This is gonna go for all Microsoft Surface Pros. Basically, you forgot your PIN or password and you can't log in to your computer. I'm gonna show you how to go ahead and basically do a factory reset. Once we do the factory reset, it'll be as if you bought the um, your Surface Pro brand new and took it out of the box, okay? So hopefully if you have any important information that you were somehow already able to save it, okay? Anyways, what you wanna do first is Go ahead and you have to use your keyboard, okay? If you don't have the keyboard that comes with the Surface Pro, you can use any other keyboard too. You can use like a regular keyboard here with a um, with a USB port, you can just plug it in there and it's plug and play and the keyboard will work right away, okay? The reason is because we need to use that shift key. So first thing is go ahead and go into your login screen right here. Next thing you wanna do is press and hold the shift button right here, press and hold. And then you wanna go over here to the power button, click on that. And then you want to tap on restart. Do not let go. I'm still holding on to the shift button, okay? Hold on to the shift button. Do not let go. Let me tap on restart. I'm still holding on to the um, shift button here. Once you see the blue screen here, you can go ahead and let go. Now from here, we got to do is we got to go down to troubleshoot right here. And then we're going to tap on reset this PC right there. Now we have two options here, okay? We can go ahead and... You can uh, keep my files, you can keep your files. Basically this will remove apps and settings, but it will keep all your personal info, or you can do the whole shebang, remove everything here, okay? We're gonna go down to remove everything. Go ahead and tap on that. Okay, now you'll get this option here that pops up, okay? So the same thing here again, uh, just remove my files. And it says, uh, use this if you are keeping your PC, or you can do the whole shebang here again, fully clean the drive. We're gonna go to fully clean the drive here, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and tap on that right there. And now this screen here will pop up, reset this PC. We're gonna go ahead and tap on reset now. Now the thing is, depending on how much stuff you have in here will depend on how much time it'll take to actually do the full factory reset. I don't have much on here, but you guys can expect, give it at least 20 or 30 minutes, okay? This process is gonna take a little while so right now it's uh, resetting here. Once it's done with the uh, the resetting, it'll reboot and then it'll go ahead and start the uh, actual installation. And like I said, this whole process is gonna take at least 20 to 30 minutes, okay? Okay, we're at 99% now. Right, it's uh, rebooting now. All right, now we're on the blue screen here. Now it's actually installing the Windows. We're at 0% right now, I'll put it back on pause. And here we go, so once it's complete, then you have to start off like I said, as if you bought a brand new, you have to start off with your region and go from there. So any questions, issues, comment below. Good luck. Your keyboard is set to...